Hello, Dana. Nice to see you as well. We got assault. Not top tier again. I'll work with it though. <laughs> like the T32, my main gripe with it is it's definitely it's weak currently. Like in the early days of tanks when I played it, it wasn't too bad. But the easiest way they can fix the T32 is the T32 was basically planned to have, I think they even had it on it. I, Cause I'm pretty sure it was prototyped at the very least. I'm not exactly the best when it comes to historical stuff, but the T32 was planned to have a 90 millimeter gun on it. Basically high penetration and more or less all they could do right now or all they should do right now to fix it keep the 105 on it maybe give it like a pinch more gun handling and accuracy leave it like it is pop on the t2065 patriots gun boom done t32 is fixed <laughs> so yeah you get the tier 5 sherman So it worked for me last time here. I'm just going to head to the center, see how it goes again. We have significantly less tanks heading here though, so I'll have to keep that in mind. I'm going to try to get a quick little shot on this guy. And luckily for him, he was back. The Skoda though is looking tempting. I'm just waiting to see if this PZ4 gives me a shot. Probably not. I should be safe to pull back through here. I just don't want to lose this opportunity. He shouldn't be able to get away, though. If he reload it, I should... ...be able to pin him. It's like tank wrestling. Oh, no, you do not want to shoot my hole, dude. <laughs> I'll risk this. <laughs> Please don't encourage people. <laughs> not that I... Not that I mind playing low tiers. I just don't want too many of them. A few, or I should say a couple of streams okay, though. so far so good this battle I really like playing that spot like it seems like I do the same thing on every single map every single match but usually the spots I go to like they just kind of line up and work like if I think they're not gonna work then I'll do something different but you know heading here even as bottom tier you have a lot of options and as long as the enemy doesn't pile people in there which if they do, you just don't push in. You know, it's a tough spot to not want to go to. I see a Tiger II coming across the way. But this bat chat. Oh, I just missed him. It was right on the money too. I just needed to fire that like a second faster half second I'll go with I missed that shot my problem is here we have three of our biggest guns camping in the bottom left corner and more or less it's assault mode like they have zero incentive to push on them. Like, zero. Like, we have a clear shot up. Like, now I'm getting artied. 
It's just... Just, you can't make it up to where... Like, come on. I gotta help him. I really don't want to do this, but... Nah, now the T-10's shooting me. Basically, from right over here, it's just... Our team's camping on attack on a very large map that they could move across. Uh, I'm gonna regret this. It's just like, come on guys. Put your big boy pants on. Move up a little bit. We're up by two. We only have five minutes left. I'm just going to regret this because I'm probably going to die because I'm starting to get impatient. <laughs> I'm just like hoping like, oh, we see an IS-3 out there. It's safe. We can push out. That's what I'm hoping for. Like, this is probably the first time you guys have seen me touch this spot of the castle. Eh. I should have held my shot because... Yeah, I could have hit him right here. You're right, little doggo. Yeah. You're welcome, T28. Since nobody else can shoot that guy for you. You little buddy. Four minutes left. <laughs> what do you want? Sorry, I have a little little dog who's recovering from surgery here so I gotta make sure he's fine I just might have to pop out and let him out if he uh, gets up again took him for two walks before the stream so he should be good still just waning afraid if I die here that they're legitimately not going to do anything. Ooh, I knew that was close. Awesome. But like, it's like pulling teeth here. <laughs> like, the, these three. Nice one, Strav S1. Maybe that's why he was saved. Uh, is he gonna drown himself to cap it off too? <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> but at the same time though, like, I don't get mad about these matches. They annoy me, but like some people will be like cursing people out in the chat and stuff. Like, that's never gonna get you anywhere. I'm just gonna push it and go for it, because if I can somehow get across here, I can spot, but like right now, my team is struggling just to like move. Here's the big gun, I'm screwed, but at least I popped them there. Oh, there's an Udez that flanked us. I am really surprised. But, like, we're down to under two minutes. Like... I feel like our best option here is the cap, even though we're up. So, I'm honestly just gonna stay on the frickin' cap, because... I would like to keep whatever options I have open <laughs> but that was a pretty nice shot there I mainly hit that because I had APCR and uh, increased shell velocity really helped that thank you very much Dana for the bits 
but like man the these people did not make it easy like we're only up by one now fortunately we capped out but like yeah <laughs> thank you very much again uh dana though i say i saw since it said uh the football uh bits here i saw that uh who lost uh brazil today uh belgium beat them i guess that was a pretty big upset <laughs> i think uh a lot of the people who uh work with us uh who were cheering for mexico they were a little bit happy <laughs> anyway i got an ace tanker here i'll say that's well deserved for what a few of those people uh, did that battle so yeah thanks for requesting the is3 there and yeah, most amount of uh, experience, 3,400 damage, 1,600 assists. This is where, like, I'm not saying that matchmaking is perfect or anything, nor do I want to, like, start a gigantic discussion about it. But if all you had was the same tier matchmaking every single time, you would lose battles like that to where you're pretty much the underdog. And not that I, like, carried my team, but I was a pretty darn big uh, reason why we won that. So, yeah. <laughs> Nothing wrong with rage quitting. Uh, it's better than, you know... Honestly, if you are getting angry at the game, it is best to just take a break. Like, granted, the only time I play right now is when I stream for tanks. But, like, it, when I used to play and get, like, annoyed... I would just log off and play a single player game. Stellaris, or back then it wasn't Stellaris, uh, like Civilization, stuff like that. Alright, T95, I'm, I'm just gonna head 